Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Day of the Tentacle Blind. My name is Squeedish and I'll be your host on this wonderful evening. And here we have Hoagie, who's also very excited to be back after a break of a few days because I had very, very, very... a big problem with neck pain, okay? Like, I know this sounds silly, but I had to, like, um... stop doing anything for a couple of days because my neck was just hurting too damn bad. I could not bear it. I could not bear it. Hello. Alright, so we need to prevent the making of the statue, if I'm correct. He has a right-handed hammer. He's a right-hander. So, what we can do is replace that hammer with something. I mean, we already tried that, right? Uh, use... I think we already Please tried this. Give me back my hammer. Alright. Here's... here. Here you go. So I guess we need something that looks like a hammer. Mm, nothing here. This might take a while. I have no idea. Maybe it's even in the future. It might not even be here. Stars and stripes, dull, yeah. dull, dull. <laughs> I like hey, that don't she. Criticize unless you got a better idea. I like that she actually has an automized like sewing machine. That is like. <laughs> I like how they made it old timey so that it kind of, sorta is supposed to make sense, but still doesn't. Guys, in case you were wondering, two hundred years ago, sewing machines didn't exist yet. I'm just saying. Let's, let's go in here, I guess. There we go! Chief! Take it. Take the left-handed hammer. How could we be so blind? We've been down hey, here before, that's right? that's a left-handed hammer, you know. I invented it myself. It was for my ungrateful slob of a left-handed son. Oh, well. Wait, doesn't that mean that if we give uh, the one son the hammer, that the left... Handed son will just continue making the statue. I feel like another puzzle is incoming. Okay, I feel like we did. We actually try to take the lab coat yet. Hey, only employees are allowed to use that right. lab coat. Right. Okay. Gotcha. Chisel. Can we take? Oh. Get me down from here. Oh yeah, that was very thank. <laughs> that was very very useful to us. Thank you very much for that sequence. I thought I thought we were gonna like unlock her, but I guess we have to get that diamond first, don't we? All right. How about we steal his hammer and give him a left-handed one? Oh no! I've lost it. That's not how hammers work. It's not how hammers work. Oh, where hath gone the muse that once guided my hand with such care? Must inspiration be so transitory? Must art be so cruel? Okay. I'm a failure. Don't say that, Ned. Father was right. We Edisons are made to be scientists, not artists. Dear brother, we must be strong in these times of creative adversity. Why don't you let me take over for a while? I'll clean this rubble up and start over. You relax. Have a cappuccino. Hmm. What? Okay, so do the I'm same glad thing. We switched places. Do the same I thing. Think you're coming out quite well. Do the same thing with him then. Oh no, that's right. Oh my god, that's genius. That's genius. How did I think of that? That is genius. All right, cool, awesome. Thanks. Oh man, that is that is fantastic. Guys, I'm such a genius. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I didn't know that the arm was gonna switch. But it makes sense. 
It definitely makes sense. Alright, so get Edna the hell out of there. Just punt, punt that nurse. Yeah, that's right. Well, you know what they say. If what you want to save the world, you gotta push a few old ladies down the stairs. Wait. She went down the stairs? But... Ed's room is right opposite from this one. Whatever. Look. Ooh, okay. 57. And he realizes that the safe is open. Okay. No, he does, he does enter it too quickly, because 57 is the only one we get. Alright, uh... There's no tape in the machine. Th but th then put one in. Didn't we have one? Yeah, there it is. Uh, use videotape. I don't know what we're taping over. Probably some poor guy's wedding or something, but eh, it doesn't matter. Okay, look. Play. Oops. 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 The tape's at the end. Oh. Play. We didn't even record yet. So rewind. Press the recording button. What? Oh, that's the stop button. EP? What is that? EP? Uh... Uh-huh. Dr. Fred Edison. Internal Revenue. Come with us. We'd like to go over some of your records with you. Oh, dear. Upstairs. Okay. I was wondering, because it seemed like it was already over at, like, 30 frames. But then these guys came in, and I was like, okay, okay, I see why it, why this is taking so long. Alright, so that guy's gone. Uh... EP? What? Play. Ah, yes. 101... Nine nine nine, nine 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 fifty seven. Cool. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Will they speak in like slow mo now? That would be awesome. Doctor Fred Edison. This game's killing me. Internal <laughs> revenue. revenue. Come. With us. Hey, they said upstairs too. This tape is clearly lying to us. We should believe it not a single word. Alright. Good that I have such a great memory. I do actually remember actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> I was gonna say I have a terrible memory, but I do actually remember. It was 101, 999, and 57. Let's do the it. The safe is closed. Well, you know the combination, I'd though. I'd not. What? Open it. Let's see. It's 101 oh. I guess he remembers, too. Nerd. Pick up contract. So this is the, con the game contract with which we make big bucks. We can finally stop, like, our job and uh, do YouTube and video games. As our main the party of the first part shall hereby be known as a crazed maniacal genius so what do I do with this do I send it in do I send it in the mail I mean I guess do I have a mailbox yeah there it is all right um use contract with mailbox it's no use we've already missed the deadline then send it to hoagie I'll use the chronogon <laughs> did they have mailboxes in uh in the 18th century 19th even 
Oh wait, no, this game was made in the in the 1990s, so it is the 18th century. Very late 18th century, but still the 18th century. Yeah, there's the old timey mailbox. Let's use our contract. I doubt they'll take it without a stamp. Bernard. There you go. Alright, now use. This is no good. It isn't signed. We need to get the doctor to sign it too. Alright. Okay. They said, um. Help wanted. Lab assistant. Hard working drone needed to assist genius with experiments. High school diploma not required. Can we get the lab code with that, I wonder? It's on the other side of the window. Oh, well, then get it from the other side of the window. Jeez, Bernard, it's not that difficult. Christ. And you want to be a nerd. You want to be a, a genius. You don't even know how to walk to the other side of things. Okay. That's fine. Help want it. I like the inventory um, sprite for that. Okay. Let's go upstairs, I guess. Excuse moi. You have my doctor. Say, what's the filing date for a BFD 206ZZ insufficient credit applications form? You have until midnight on the 12th working day past the first full moon after the end of your fiscal year. However, oh. you can extend the day by filing an RPM 78 waning interest extension any time before the close of business on the second Tuesday after the first Friday of March. And of course, if you're married, you'd also have to file the K7209 Statement of Joint Intentions and declare any mutual gift expenditures. Sup? So, what is it? You have my doctor. What have you done with my doctor? What have you done with Dr. Fred? We've got him safely locked in the next room while we go over his books. No, you can't go in and see him. And don't even think about staging some kind of rescue. We're staging some kind of rescue. Are you guys brothers? Are you guys brothers? At the IRS, we're all brothers. Okay, I want- I so badly want someone in the comments to be like, I am an IRS agent and I can confirm or deny these... rumors. <laughs> I don't know. Who's your tailor? Is it Swift? Who's your tailor? Very funny. I'll just be moseying along. <laughs> it's Keep it's your like he. Clean, kid. It's it's like he reacted to my joke. Get out of here. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Uh, I'm I'm not gonna be able to speak much when I go back up there, but I'll try like going out of the window there, if that's possible. How do you suppose the Dodgers are doing? Well, their win-loss ratio is 28% below normal. However, the successful slide margin is actually up three points since May. I've noticed that... What a bunch of nerds. Do they say that, I, that the IRS people have no souls? Because that's what I'm getting from this. Can we scoot over there? Thank you. So, I think we need to go up the... Up the fireplace? Yeah. And then it would be this window, right? I guess it wouldn't really matter. I guess they're both... Hello. Oh, God. What have they done to you? Why is he, why is he like, mummified? <laughs> that... is, is that what happened to all the other mummies? Did they all not pay their, pay their taxes? Oh, damn. G O oh, G Wiz. We're in it now. Um Can we just pick him up? Pick up rope. Yeah, awesome. I like how he opened his pocket up. Use Dr. Fred with window. I don't think I can do that. Why not? Can we tie something at the end of his foot? I just got him untied. 
Well, but there's a pulley outside, so if we attach something heavy to it, surely it will work. Um, open up, Dr. Fred? It doesn't seem to open. Talk to Dr. Dr. Fred. Fred. Must still be asleep. Get him some coffee. Get him some... We have a, we have a funnel. No time for fun now. I've got to get him out of here. Oh my god, did you have to make that pun? Um, use coffee on him? Hmm, I don't know. It's powerful stuff. Yeah, that's why we're using it. Can we just put a hamster in his pants? Maybe, maybe that'll wake him up and get him all excited. <laughs> uh, chattering teeth with that's Dr. That's a Rick? stupid thing to do with a perfectly good set of chattering teeth. Alright, I get it. You don't want... But what am I supposed to do then? Do I, do we push the bed? I wouldn't want to strain myself. Do we pull the I bed? I wouldn't want to strain myself. Push him out of the window? <laughs> that sounds terrible. Whoa, okay. Uh oh Hey, where'd he go? Ah, there you are. <clears throat> Just lie there and take it like a man. Damn. I, I'm, look, I'm not even going to make that joke. You all know <laughs> what kind of joke you can make there. I'm not going to get into it. Alright, so they complained because it was too loud. Kinda. So, can we get a mattress or something? Not really. We need to get him out of there. But how do we get him out of there, is the question. Uh, well, I mean... With red paint, what if we give that to Bernard? Because he's red. What if we replace Dr. Fred with Mummy Guy Mc McGee? Crank box. We don't need the crank. We need the pulley. Can we use the rope with the pulley? We can. Uh, can we use rope? I'd rather not. Can we pick up what the for? end of the rope? Okay, I see. Fair enough. I guess we just go downstairs to the mummy then. <laughs> but I'm unsure how it would work. Well, I guess it looks pretty easy. Okay, fine. Let's see if we can't paint this guy. Where's the paint bucket? There it is. We can! That's the plan! Alright. Ted is red. See red Ted. Bernard. No. Oh, wait. Did, did I not? There we go. Uh wow. This game has some dark humor. Adult humor. I guess not too many birds bathe in the evening. True, but are we just going to let that stay there? Because I imagine it's heavy, so we might not be able to pull it up. Or am I just, like... Am I just nitpicking now? I might be doing that. Okay, upstairs. Upstairs we go. Let's see if, if we can lift this guy. I doubt it, since we're a really scrawny nerd that has no strength, whose arms literally are one pixels wide. I'm just saying. I don't think it'll work. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, fireplace. I'm sorry. I'm silly. How could I forget that you're not supposed to take the stairs into the attic, but the fireplace? Makes total sense. <laughs> Alright, okay. I just want to unlock Laverne, because it makes me feel like there's still so much of the game left. If we haven't even unlocked the third character. Alright, how do we... do we use it? Do we use the I'd rope? Rather not. Do we pick it up? What for? Just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. That sounds good. Here, take this. No, that, that's for later, for the scan. It's green. That was Ashley, red! I need to tell you something. 
Ashley, you're colorblind. No, no, it's not like that. Why now?